Welcome to today's edition of Crypto Corner at InvestorIdeas.com, news on what's driving the cryptocurrency market. This podcast was sponsored by cryptocurrency payment technology Flip, a creation of FitPay Inc., a leading provider of cutting-edge payment technology and a subsidiary of NextID, traded on the NASDAQ under the ticker symbol NXTD. Next ID is a provider of healthcare devices as well as payment credential management and authentication platform services. Learn more about how to order Flip at fliptopay.com. And Crypto Corner is also sponsored by Genesis Blockchain Technologies or GBT. GBT is a powerful cryptocurrency centralized decentralized exchange which will include a broad range of services and benefits from cryptocurrency and blockchain markets development while avoiding complications and risks arising from cryptocurrency ownership, transfer, and exchange. You can download the Genesis Exchange and Wallet app at Google Play and on the Apple App Store. Learn more at www.mygenesis.io. Total market capitalization has seen a slight improvement over the last 24 hours, with a gain of about $4 billion U.S. since yesterday's crypto corner. This puts the total market cap at $111 billion at the time of recording, according to data from CoinMarketCap. Most of the top 100 coins listed by market cap are in the green, with the ones that aren't mostly being stable coins. A report from Gulf News states that the Central Bank of the United Arab Emirates is working with the Saudi Arabian Monetary Authority on a joint digital currency to be used in cross-border transactions between the two countries. In a speech at a meeting for the Arab region on global banking standards and regulatory and supervisory priorities, the UAE Central Bank Governor Mubarak Rashid al-Mansouri said, quote, This is probably the first time ever that witnesses the cooperation of monetary authorities from different countries on this topic, and we hope that this achievement will foster similar collaboration in our region, end quote. According to Dutch outlet Galaxy Club, electronics giant Samsung has filed for three blockchain-related patents in the European Union. They are called Blockchain Key Store, Blockchain Key Box, and Blockchain Core. The article, citing an unnamed source, says that more information will soon follow. Another Dutch outlet, De Telegraph, reports that the Dutch central bank will require crypto exchanges to have a license. The aim of this regulation is to prevent money laundering and the funding of terrorism. Gemini CEO and co-founder Tyler Winklevoss announced the launch of the Gemini mobile app for trading cryptocurrencies in a Medium post yesterday. The app allows users to buy and sell on the go, monitor market prices and portfolio, set price alerts and recurring buy orders, and more. And the Canadian city of Calgary has launched a digital currency for intra-city transactions, according to a report from local outlet Global News. Called Calgary Dollars, the currency was unveiled last Friday by the provincial finance minister Joe Sisi. According to the report, Calgary Dollars runs through a smartphone app and lists shops and restaurants that participate in the program. That does it for today's Crypto Corner. If you would like to be a guest or sponsor for this podcast, contact InvestorIdeas.com. Investor Ideas reminds all listeners to read our disclaimers and disclosures on the InvestorIdeas.com website. And this podcast is not an endorsement to buy products, services, or securities. Investors are reminded all investment involves risk and possible loss in investment. To hear more InvestorIdeas.com podcasts, please visit InvestorIdeas.com slash audio. And a reminder, you can also hear our podcasts on Spotify, iTunes, TuneIn, Stitcher, Spreaker.com, iHeartRadio.com, and Google Play Music. For disclosure purposes, Next ID is a PR news and social media featured company on InvestorIdeas.com.